This is Accelerate Game, and I'm continuing my evacuation. This time I'm doing multiplayer. And we're on day four already, so we're hunting. That means we're going to be going after the monster. So it should be pretty interesting going up against a human player that's controlling the monster. From what I've seen so far, if they're really good in understanding the monster, it could be a lot more challenging, of course. And so some are really good while some could be mediocre it just really depends on, on their skill level now I don't know I'm joining this game so I don't really know how many wins or losses they have Okay, and it looks like I will have to take over the bot. Okay, so where's Daisy? Okay. Alright, so I started. Somebody must have left the middle of the game or something. Oh, really, Daisy? So this cat and mouse game could be frustrating at times. There's a carnivorous plant here. Depending on the mods. And right now we have not spotted a monster yet. I don't know how long this game has been playing, but uh, and I don't really know what, what stage of monster is. It could be stage two. I don't think it's stage three because if it was, it would probably most likely look for us. Deploying UAV, which is to say my grenade out! Don't get caught! Come on, Daisy. Taking down some aggressive wildlife. Okay, where did he go? If the monster jumps up, to oh no. Here, waiting to eat some more. These traps are annoying. Oh, this is disgusting. Little help. Oh. Okay, you know what? We must have lost a lot of games because there's a lot of traps in this map. Between the poisonous gas, these uh, little annoying birds or whatever you want to call them. This has been one trap after the other, so I don't really think... Great! How many traps are there? Guys! I'm being very slowly Yeah, digested. something about a man you plan just really brings out a worst thing. Find it. Damn it, Daisy. Boy, what's that chumpa? Oh, gosh. This monster is really difficult to find. Oh. Oh. 
Albino here. Okay, it's in the distance. Drop here. Don't get eaten. Give me a second. I got you. Getting a better view. Okay, so now we stay. Step lighter, you lots. It looks like our teammates keep quitting and leaving. I'm not sure. Well, I can understand why. I mean, this stage is filled with all sorts of plant trap, monkey trap, turd trap, whatever the hell else trap. Wait, where is it? Oh, there he is. On each other, Daisy. Harpoon traps ready. Just die fucking jesting me. Oh, wow, that was out. so lucky. I mean, literally, I could have sneezed on him and he would have died. And he got away uh, just in the nick of time. That bastard. Ugh. I will track you to the end of the world. Or the end of this map, whichever comes first. We're come on, Daisy. Come on, girl. Where are we? Oi! Watch that chomper! Oh, there he is. Step lightly, you lot! Take cover! Fucking Goliath wouldn't have made it one minute where I'm from! Uh, Bloody shield is low! Shield's out! So low. Oh. Here's some putrid dead! Have a missile! Time to die. He is, uh, whenever. Okay, so whenever you, as the trapper, if you have the mobile arena up, that way, the, if they knock you down or, or disable you, that lowers the arena. So it doesn't matter Fire when you throw it, if you get knocked down right afterwards, then that's their way of escaping. So it's good that you try to. When you throw the mobile arena down, you gotta hide because you're like number one target, especially if he's trying to escape. If he's not trying to escape, then hey, it doesn't matter. He'll just stay there and fight. But since. Okay. This poison cloud is making it hard to see anything. Oh, plant. I hate for the man even plant. Track gun ready! You know what? I feel like his trapper movement speed has to be critical. Don't step in the plot! Even if he's right to do. He should be able to find him fast and trap him. Come 
Getting a kill. There he is. Okay, he found him. Good, good, good. No! Stay, no! Where are you going? No! Okay, maybe they weren't really engaging. Oh, come on. This is so close. Ah, we got him twice and he got like away twice. Ugh. Birds in the air! Ugh. He's probably full health though, to be honest. Beginning high altitude. Oh, come on! Goliath, opening fire! On your feet, Bow. Can't let the rest of these people get themselves killed, can we? Okay. We need to stick together because we're kind of separated right now. And the worst part is when the plants trap you, you cannot get out without a teammate's help. So sometimes you're not paying attention, your teammate can get eaten by a plant. You become plant free. Literally. And figuratively. Okay, come on. I swear, I was like, the next game I play, I am so. Oh, there he is! No, that's not him. Damn it. Ugh. I thought it was something else. It looked like it almost. has been smart twice. He got almost had him twice and he got away twice. So I have to give him props to that. That was our fault. And it's probably not smart me going out by myself, so I'm gonna go back. Now to see what we can see. Yeah, let's stick to the power we agree. Yeah, no shit. 
he was beating on my face for like a good 10, 15 seconds. Jeez. You're not gonna die. Ah! Even though I got murdered Go in the beginning of the fight, but hey, you know what? It's a team game. Sometimes you kind of have to be the sacrificial lamb so your team can prevail. It's better me dying, especially now that it doesn't. We don't really need to trap him because it's either do or die for him. Versus, say the assault died or the support. Died. In a way, if the monster doesn't really need to be trapped for like when he's level three, the trapper can f focus more on doing damage and limiting its movement while you're fighting it. The level up system is a bit uh, restrictive at first, but I heard it gets better the, later on. Alright, so this is day five. We are defending. So it should be a little bit more interesting. Although that that monster last game, Goliath, he was really good with a charge. It was really difficult to dodge him. Overall, I think they did a really good job with this. Um, I wish the single player was a little bit longer, uh, but it looks like they focused more on the, the gameplay itself and make sure that it was really good, which is you know it, it plays to longevity. I mean that's why Call of Duty is really popular, mostly because of its multiplayer. Single player is really good, but after most people beat it the first time, they don't really play it through again unless it's maybe to get like trophies or do something else. So. This one looks like it's focused more on enjoying the fact that you f you are fighting a boss like battle with a person with a human player that can adapt. And there's the infamous Dune buggy or Dune beetle or whatever that thing that looks like from the Starship Troopers. Yes, definitely recharge faster. Right? So we got Val, Bucket, and Par Parnell. Parnell. 
and we're going against Goliath stage three. Hmm. Looking doomsday. Although Daisy kind of remind me of a pet I had that was pretty tenacious. I used to call her a sassy because she was very aggressive and and just like protecting the house, whether it's like chasing mat rats away or other things. Even though she was much smaller than uh, than her attitude dictated. All right, uh, we are defending, so I uh, don't think we need a gun. Daisy, get back over here. Thing is coming. Monster scared birds. What is that? Oh, there they are. Minions. And no, these aren't the minions from the, 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 the despicable me. So that would be funny if there wasn't any Oh, yeah. At least now it can for a little bit more damage. And crap. Die, die, die. You're healed up, support! Daisy, what do you smell? <gasps> Something's coming. There you go. What's that? Closer and closer. Should be really interesting to see how this goes. Right now, uh, where is this damn monster? Uh, yes, and now my wife is, uh, I have wife aggro, and she's bothering me while I'm trying to murder this monster. Yes, black aggro is the worst. Oh, whoa, there he is. Great. The monster came right at the best spot when we get harassed. I don't like. Okay, good job. Yeah. I'm a lesson. Oh, now he's gonna run. Oh, he's gonna run? Oh, you act all big and bad, but you have armor now. You trying to run? I don't run away, homie. Don't be scared, homie. Oh, where, you, where, are you, where did he go? Oh yeah. Oh, look, I wonder if you I've never really killed a monster in defend before, so I'm curious to see if that would happen. Nope. Nope, you are not getting away. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice try though. Nice try. You got a food. Okay, so if you kill the monster and defend, you automatically win. <laughs> yes, <it always laughs> that was not very you smart of him to stick around. I mean, as soon as I saw that his life drop 30%, I just popped the mobile arena. I was like, you are not running. So that was a not exactly the smartest monster in the forest or jungle or wherever you want to call his home. So that was a very funny uh, match right there. Despite having life aggro. <laughs> okay. 
go ahead and skip this because we've already seen it. Level 7. And so I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up uh, for multiplayer. You kind of see different aspects of how the monster could be uh, controlled by humans. So uh, it's definitely, you know, good. Uh, definitely give this game a try if you haven't. It's really good if you like, if you're into like squad-based game and you like a challenge. The monsters are not easy. Some of the videos that I wasn't able to upload, the monster actually won more than the hunters. So it was, it was not easy. So. Uh, with that, uh, thank you again, and I'll um, stay tuned for you know future uploads.